Welcome back to Berlin Film Photography. My name is Jakub and today I'm going to show you how to make real darkroom prints for under 30 euros, even if you're completely new to darkroom printing. It's getting cold in Europe right now and as we film photographers say, um, winter time is darkroom time. So um, if you are a film photographer yourself and you always wanted to do some real darkroom printing, or if you just found some old negatives from, let's say, uh, your grandpa's, uh, in your grandpa's archives, uh, maybe even grandpa's um, camera, you maybe have wondered what's on those uh, negatives. And the best way to find this out is actually to print them. Um, if you've never done printing before, um, developing real analog pictures, uh, you may not have done this due to the fact that you think you do not have enough equipment, you do not have enough space at home and you basically don't know what to buy, what you will need and maybe you have the thought that this is just super expensive to do so. Um, that's absolutely not the case and I'm going to show you today how to do prints with the help of the Paper Exposer app for just under 30 euros. You will get a whole darkroom, a whole functioning darkroom. The only thing you need is some negatives, your own or your grandpa's camera and a tripod. But when you are a film photographer, I assume you have these things already.
So we are done with this. Um, this is the picture we came up with. I hope it's not too glossy now in the studio light so you can still see uh, what's going on here. Um, we made this with a, with a dark room for less than 30 euros, which is incredible. You just have to use your camera, the paper exposer app, you just have to work a little bit with stuff you get uh, in the art shop or in the supply store. Uh, some of the things we actually bought to set up our little dark room, you will uh, have forever. They will last forever. The only thing you will need to buy is uh, the paper and the chemicals basically. Everything else you already have. So this is just a very small amount of constant costs you're going to produce. If you want to go bigger at some point with bigger images, like let's say uh, 30 by 40 centimeters, which is totally not a problem with the app, you will be in the need for uh, another easel, you will be in need for uh, other trays, so uh, they will get bigger as your um, photos that you develop get bigger. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the session with me about uh, how to set up a very cheap, uh, very functional uh, darkroom and uh, share this with your friends. As I told you um, in the introduction, it's winter time in Europe and winter time is darkroom time. So stay tuned, enjoy and share the video. Thank you. Mm -hmm.